How can Python be helpful for civil engineers? This question had raised the eagerness of every other civil engineer. Now it's time to resolve each and every uncertainty that civil engineers have in their minds. Like every other field, applications of data science are also involved in civil engineering. Python in this regard is considered to be one of the most in-demand and favored programming languages. Using Python, we have seen a lot have favorable outcomes. A glimpse of these accomplishments is shown below. Prediction of natural hazards like floods, earthquakes, and cyclones for tangible risk evaluation. Population estimation for urban planning and developing water supply, water treatment, and sewerage system for a specific population. Effective soil simulation and modeling in geotechnical engineering which is also a branch of civil engineering. Substantial construction management. Correlative design for reinforced concrete structures. This list covers most of the latest applications of data science using Python in civil engineering. With the evolution of every industry, automation in civil engineering is also taking place everywhere around the world. All of this has been made possible due to the constructive use of data science in the field of civil engineering. But why Python is considered as the most reliable language? Let's discover why. The reason that Python is the most in-demand and approved programming language is just because of its extensive and always upgrading libraries, user-friendly, adaptability, flexibility, and incredible use in the latest technologies. Hence there are a bunch of reasons why most people prefer Python over other languages. Let's observe some real-life examples in the field of civil engineering which uses Python and provides tremendous ease. One of the major elements that are used in modern construction is reinforced concrete structures. Reinforced concrete is a versatile compound and is used to increase the overall firmness. With the help of various structural layouts, it seems to be necessary for the analysis and design of structures some software should be used. Every software has its own way of working which needs to be understood before using it. So it was considered preferable to develop one's own software using any kind of programming language. Here comes Python which proves to be highly user-friendly since a user without having any prior or deep knowledge in programming can also start working on Python programs. One of the best advantages of using Python for developing programs for the analysis and design of reinforced concrete structures is that a designer can easily create an interactive design. Also, these programs can be easily shaped into executable software and can create more opportunities for learning and development. Python has immense documentation regarding all the libraries available on the official website for the assistance of Python programmers. A few practical functions of Python which are used in reinforced concrete structures are illustrated below. The sample code is a Python program for the type of beam section. It is required to examine the design in order to evaluate whether the design is at the most balanced section or an underreinforced section. Here the beam can be considered to be an element or member which is composed of a bunch of materials like wood, steel, and aluminum to hold out against loads. There exist numerous Python libraries that can help in the field of civil engineering for a better understanding of analysis, designs, and to perform the numerical evaluation. One of the most important libraries in Python which proves to be highly beneficial is NumberPy. The reason why NumberPy is considered to be most significant is just that it provides ease in performing calculations. For instance, during construction, we have to implant for sheer strength of the concrete on the basis of percentage of reinforcement and grade of concrete. This requires some multidimensional arrays for finer calculations and these multidimensional arrays are provided by the number PY library since it provides the facility to create them conveniently. Other libraries include Pandas, SciPy, and Matplotlib. Using these packages it becomes quite easy to perform numerical reasoning and to shape sensational graphics. Using the Pandas library, a programmer would have access to MS Excel and would be able to manipulate large data with spreadsheets. Using Matplotlib library, numerous types of 2D graphs can be easily drawn that help in designing, building, and testing. This library also provides the facility to formulate remarkable power spectra, bar charts, and histograms. 
using SciPy library which is considered to be highly significant for mathematics and engineering, a lot of numerical calculations can be performed like differential equation solution, performing numeral integration, etc. Using the import function of the Python standard library, any library can be included and can be used. Making use of Python libraries and Python programs a bunch of perks can be gained. These perks include statistical analysis, data analysis, GIS analysis, and mathematical analysis. Some problem solving strategies, data interpretation, and manipulation are also included in these perks for better understanding and solving of the problem. The next big ultimatum is automation in every field of engineering, especially in civil engineering. This makes the learning of new techniques and strategies through data science quite mandatory for every civil engineer. Python language in this regard makes it up to the mark to assist you to gain miraculous advantages.